All right, so we're gonna jump right into it. So the very first pair of jeans are these skinny jeans. They are stretchy. I got these in a size small and I wanted to see if it had a decent amount of stretch in them. My regular size is a medium, if you guys didn't know, and I got a small. So as you can see, they fit really, really well, actually. I like this wash. I like the distressing on the bottom. The material is very comfortable. It's soft, it's stretchy, like I said. The pockets look a little weird. I don't like how the pockets are so small and looks really weird on my butt, but I do really like the wash of these jeans and I really, really like the way they fit. So you guys, let me know what y'all think about these down below. So next up we have another pair of skinny jeans and these I do not like. Number one, the color in the picture and the color in person are clearly nowhere the same. Um, in person, they're very light and there's a lot of extra fabric in the crotch area, which I don't like. I got these in a medium and I think because they're so stretchy, they have like a bunch of loose fabric there. So I honestly could have gotten away with a small, but they are pretty short too, which I don't like. I like for my jeans to go all the way down. My inseam is about 28 and a half to a 29. So I prefer my jeans to go down pretty far. Um, I don't like my ankle exposed because it looks weird and I have really skinny ankles so the jeans just look weird but these are okay. These also have really small pockets which look really weird on my butt and I don't know. I don't really like the color of these jeans. I don't like the style. I don't like the fabric. I don't really like these. So these are a no for me but I've seen a lot of people in the reviews say they love them so definitely go check the reviews and see how you guys feel about them but they're not my cup of tea. So next up we have a pair of jeans that I'm not really feeling either. I think it's because they're just too tight. As you can see at the waist area, it looks like it's just eating my stomach. It's, they're cute. The jeans are really nice, but I don't know. I got these in a medium and they're really low and I don't really do low rise jeans. I just wanted to get some different types of jeans for this video. And as you can see, they are cuffed at the bottom. They fit all the way down my leg, so I do like that, but I just don't like how low rise they are and how tight they are. Maybe a medium would have fit a little bit better, but I do feel like a medium would have been too big or too loose. So these are not my favorite. They're not flattering at all. So yeah, these are a no. So next up, these are the exact same pair of jeans as the ones before the last ones. And as you can see, these aren't the same color as the photo either. The photo, they're much darker. And in person, they're definitely a lot lighter. And these are literally the same exact jeans, the same fit. I don't like them like that, honestly. These I also got in a medium. As you can see, they're pretty cropped. Not a fan because the little flare out at the end of the ankle. I mean, that's just completely up to my ankles because they're so skinny, but I just don't like that look. And as you can see, they have a nice amount of stretch to them and they fit. There's no gapping, none of that, but I just don't think these are flattering on me personally. Not a fan. And the pockets, once again, are too small. Not feeling them. So yeah, these had really good reviews, but I just don't like the way they look on me. So next up, we literally have the same pair of jeans. I just wanted to get them in different colors to see how I feel about them. So these are the black ones also in a size medium and they're giving me the same thing. I mean, I'm not really a huge fan of these jeans. I can imagine that someone shorter, they will look a lot better on if you want me to be honest. But for me, I'm just not really feeling them. Um, it's just, like I said, the style of the jean, the cut at the bottom, the fabric in the front, I just, it's just not a good jean for my body specifically, but I definitely think that it's a good jean. If you wanted to get some very affordable jeans, I think these are a good pick, but just not for my body type. So next up we have a pair of flare jeans and these I got in a size 28, which is a US 6. And as you can see, they're a little tight around my waist and I actually featured these jeans in a previous Shein video and I got them in a size 8 and I love them but I wanted to try them in a size 6. So this is what the size 6 looks like. It doesn't look bad. As you can see on the side they are very long. All the jeans that are pretty long and have a decent amount of length I'm going to wear heels and then all the jeans that are pretty short I'm going to wear my forces so you guys can see. But these actually fit pretty 
pretty okay, not gonna lie. Um, if I just, you know, lose like two pounds, it'll look really good around the waist, but it looks a little snug. So I definitely need to work on that, but I think it fits pretty well actually. So I really like these and they just look, they actually look really good. So next up we have a pair of cargo pants and these I just got cause I've been seeing them all over the place. So these I got in a size medium because they had a lot of stretch when I looked at the description. It said that they had a lot of stretch so I got a medium just to be on the safe side but I don't really like the way they fit in the front there's a lot of you guys probably can't really see it but I can feel it it's like really stretchy so there's that extra fabric in the front that just I just don't like it I don't know maybe if I would have gotten a small I feel like a small would have been too short though so that's why I got a medium but these have a lot of stretch to them so if you want to size down I would definitely recommend you do um, if you have a weird torso like me, the front is always a problem low-key for me, so that's not the jeans fault, that's just my body, but I'm not a fan of these either, to be honest, but they're cute though. So these are one of my favorites. There is a, a con, but these are definitely one of my favorites. I love this slant waistline. I am obsessed with how it fits. I have tried some $60 pair of jeans, okay, that had this slant waistline and they fit terribly. I hated them with a passion and they did not look good. But these are literally like perfect around my waist. Now the only thing about these jeans that is a con for me is that they're too short. Now they may not look too short, but I would like for them to be probably an inch longer. If they were an inch longer, they'd be perfect. But I would not be able to wear these with heels without them looking like high waters. So that's a bummer, but this is what the back looks like. Just gives you, you know, the long booty like all mom jeans do. And I just wanted to give you guys a close up of the waistline. Love these. Okay, these are a 10 out of 10. If they were a little bit longer, they'd be like a 15 out of 10. But these are definitely one of my favorites. So next up is also a 10 out of 10 for me. These are some straight leg, distressed, super duper high waisted. Like these go a good inch above my belly button like these are really high-waisted jeans and these are super long I love how long these are I actually have heels on in the trial portion I'm 5'7 all my measurements will be down below per usual but these are perfect I love the wash I love the fit the waist everything is literally perfect with these jeans there is not much stretch but I was able to get into them with no problem so I would say that these jeans are very true to size so these jeans I got in a size medium and they have a really nice sturdy material. A lot of the other jeans in this video I will let you guys know. I don't want to say cheap but the material is very thin for a jean which lets you know that it is on the cheaper side but these do not feel like that. These feel like some $50, $60 jeans. Like these are really really nice you guys. I'm not even... These are really nice. Okay these are one of my favorites. Definitely top three. So next up we have a pair of high-waisted distressed jeans and once I stop dancing you guys will be able to see but the waist on here fits me really really well. I love how snug they are. There's not much gapping at all. These I really like. Now these are also a little bit on the shorter side for me. They do fit all the way down but I like to wear my jeans with heels okay. I love to wear my jeans with heels so if I can't then it's it's usually a no for me. But with these types of jeans, I could also tie my heels around the jeans. That's how I get away with shorter jeans. If you guys don't know, I like to tie the heels around my jeans when my jeans are not as long as I like them to be. So I'll probably do that with these. But these fit pretty good. Very true to size. If you guys look at the measurements on the size on Shein, you'll see exactly the measurements. And I would say these are true to size. So next up, we have another pair of high-waisted wide leg jeans and these are nice as well but they are also not as long as I'd like them to be. I don't know what it is about the length of their jeans. I don't know what that's about but these are not doing it for me at the bottoms. These I got in a size medium if I didn't say that already and they do fit really well but I do wish they were just an inch. Okay just give me an inch just one inch longer and I'd be good. I really like this wash as well. I don't have a wash 
like this. These jeans don't have much stretch to them, but there's enough stretch in there for you to get into them. I can't really explain it. The material is not stretchy, but it, it works. I don't know. Do y'all get what I'm trying to say? Like, I don't know. The, these are honestly true to size. I'm just going to keep saying that because they, they really are. So next up, I wanted to get something a little different. And these are in a size medium. And I don't really know how I feel about these. I mean, I personally don't think I would even wear these, but I wanted to get a different style of jean in this video. So, I mean, they're cool, they're different. If this is your style, like, they're pretty cool, but I wouldn't know what to wear with these, honestly. If they were a little bit more fitted, I think I'd like them more because they do fit a little loose. So I could have possibly gotten into a small, but I'm not sure. They're not stretchy, but like I said, there's enough in there for you to get into them so maybe a small would have looked a little bit better but these are they're a lot but as you can see they are very long so that's a plus i do have on heels and they do still touch the floor so if you're tall these are going to be perfect for you but i don't know y'all let me know how y'all feel about these in the comments so next up we have another pair of wide leg jeans and these are just in the darker wash Literally the same pair as the light wash jeans I showed you before, but these are also not long enough. I I don't even know anymore. I really like these jeans, but I just wish they were a little bit longer. I don't know. You guys may think that they look perfectly fine, but if I put on a pair of heels, I should have did that to show you guys what they look like, but they look like... <laughs> They're trying to touch the floor, but they just can't. Like, they want to so bad, but they just can't. Like, I don't like that look on me personally. It doesn't look cute to me. But these jeans are nice. I'm not gonna lie, I probably won't wear these because, I don't know. They don't look bad, but like I said, they're just not long enough for me. So, I'm okay. These jeans also do not have any stretch to them. They are pretty stiff but enough for you to get into them. So honestly, that's all I need. I don't need something to be super stretchy. I just need you to be able to get into it. So I do like these, but just not my cup of tea at the bottom. So next up, these are hands down in my top three as well. These I love so freaking much, you guys. These jeans are super high-waisted. They're super distressed in the front and the back they have this really cute design where one of the pockets is missing and then the other one is there. They're super long. As you can see, I have on heels and these heels are about five inches high. So you do the math, sis. But these jeans are really nice. I really like them a lot. And these are a size large, but I also have a size medium. So I think I'm gonna go with the medium because these do fit, but they're a little loose in the waist area. So I think I'm gonna go with the medium instead of the large. But these still fit really nice if you want more of a relaxed fit. So next up we have a pair of high-waisted mom jeans. And these, I I like them. But yet again, they're just too short. You guys are going to hear this over and over and over again. These I got in size medium. And as you can see, there's like a tiny bit of gapping in the back. Just a small amount, but enough to be okay. They're, it's not like crazy or anything. And as you can see in the Tron portion, the inseam looks like it's about a 27, maybe. So it doesn't go all the way down for me. Like I said, mine is like a 28 and a half, 29. So I do like them and they are very cute casual jeans. If you wanted to just be very like chill, wear some sandals, some sneakers, whatever, but they're just not long enough for me. What is going on, Shein? Come on. So next up, these are also a 10 out of 10, girl. 10 out of 10. Love these jeans so much. As you can see, they're super duper high-waisted. These are in a medium, and they're very, very long. Do you guys see this? It's like a boyfriend-style jean at the bottom, but a mom jean at the top. These are so nice. And as you can see, it does have a decent amount of gap in back there, but that's nothing to get it taken in. I really love these jeans. I'm in love with the bottom. Like they look really cute. They're like stacks almost. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you see me post a picture in some stacked jeans. These are kind of giving me that vibe a little bit just with some distressing. So I'm really here for these. Like I'm gonna be wearing these very, very soon. 
because I love the way these fit. Okay, so next up we have a pair of jeans from the men's section. And I wanted to show you guys that if you ever want to get a pair of jeans to kind of go with like a really baggy, not super high-waisted, like 90s feel, definitely shop in the men's section because they will give you that look. The only thing I don't like about these jeans is the placement of the distressing. It looks too perfect for me. I wish it was a little bit more rugged and spread out. These I got in a size 34 because based on the measurements, they kind of match mine. So I like these, but like I said, I'll probably honestly go in and distress them a little bit more. But these are really nice and I wanted to show you guys a pair of jeans from the men's section. So these jeans are, okay, so these are boyfriend jeans. And I got these in a 32, which according to the site is a US 14. Okay, so the issue with that is that these run very small. So if you are, I would say bigger than a size eight, these probably won't work for you because you have to size up like 14 sizes. So I like these jeans and they are 100% cotton, which is why they run so small, but they're definitely not friendly for everyone's sizes, if that makes any sense. So I like them, but yeah, I would say if you're past like an eight to 10, these are not gonna be a good pick because I don't know exactly how high the jeans go up to, but they're gonna run very small. So next up, we have another pair of just high-waisted jeans. I actually featured these earlier in the video in a little bit of a lighter wash, and I didn't like them because they're too short, but I do like the way they fit. So I really like this wash. I like the distressing. I like the fit around the waist. They're just not long enough for me. These I got in a size medium, and as you can see in the back, there's like a tiny bit of gapping, but that's easily fixed to just get, you know, taken in. And I like them, like I said, but these are just not long enough for me. They're a nice wash. I could possibly get away with strapping my heels around these, but when the jeans are too short, it just looks kind of funny. So I don't know if I'll be wearing these, but yeah. So next up, we have a pair of white high-waisted mom jeans, and you can barely see them, but you can see that they're a little bit tight around my waist. So they do fit like on my hips and thighs and everything but they're a little bit too tight around my waist. I got these in a size medium and they fit really well. I just need to stop eating so much. Girl, I lost all that weight and I'm about to gain it all back. Girl, calm down. So these are what the jeans look like. So as you can see, the length of them is okay. It's not super duper long, but it's definitely the length of my inseam. So I could get away with wearing these with heels without it looking weird. I just put on sneakers because they were right there, but these I really do like. I don't really have any pairs of white mom jeans for whatever reason, so I definitely wanted to include some in this video. Comment down below if you guys prefer for your mom jeans to fit on the tighter side or you would like for them to fit a little bit looser, like the typical mom jean, like you would see back in the day where they would wear them, they would be very, not loose, but just very comfortable fitting. I like them both ways. It just depends on what I'm wearing it with, honestly but these are a little bit too tight low-key just a little bit so i don't know but i do have another pair in the next clip to show you guys as well so these actually fit a little bit more looser a little bit more comfortable these are in a size medium as well and as you can see around my waist area they're not like it's not like it looked in the last one basically and also these are not as long but i don't mind wearing heels with mom jeans like this because it doesn't look weird. Um, these are a nice length as you can see. In the photo she has them rolled up so she must be a little bit shorter than me because mine are not and as you can see they do go like right at the bottom of my ankle. So that is why I paired these with heels so you guys can see what they look like and these are a 10 out of 10 for me. These definitely fit way better than the, the previous mom jeans before this clip these are definitely a go for me they just need to be ironed okay so next up are the butterfly jeans okay you guys went crazy on my instagram when i posted this photo and i loved these jeans when i seen them in the picture so in the picture that's actually the true color of the jeans but my lights are so freaking bright that it made them look white these jeans are actually an off-white color and they do not look this vibrant as they do on camera or this crispy white they're actually off-white and they do have butterflies on the right pocket 
and on the back pockets on the back of the jeans. And then on the left leg, the entire left leg is covered in butterflies. And I am terrified of butterflies, but I love these jeans. These I got in size medium, and these are a true mom jean. The material is nice and thick. The quality is amazing. The only thing I don't like is they're not long enough. So next up we have a pair of high-waisted light wash mom jeans, and these fit really, really high-waisted. I love that. They don't fit super tight and just basically eating my stomach, like I said before. And these are really nice. There's no gapping. The length is a little short. We already knew that though. Okay, we already knew that, girl. But these are a little, a little short for me. But these I could definitely get away with wearing with heels. These are probably the style of jean that I would wrap my heel around because although they're not super short, they're just not a comfortable length for me. And the gapping in the back is like non-existent, so I love that. These are some really nice jeans, okay? I will give it that. They don't have any stretch, but enough for you to get into it. It's not a struggle at all. These, I really like the wash, and I don't have any super light wash jeans, so I love these so much. So next up, we have another pair of mom jeans, and these have a really nice top on them, like the... What do you want to call it? The waist area looks really cool. I like the way it looks. These are also in a size medium and these are also not the longest, but they don't look weird with heels. I tried them on in the charm portion so you guys can see that. These, I really like the design of them. I like how there's like a pinch at the waist area and then there's like a pinch at the hem at the bottom. I don't know if that makes any sense, but I like the, the hem on these. They're really cute and different and they don't look super plain like most of the mom jeans in this video and i like the way these fit a lot these look really really good these are a nice quality as well not much stretch per usual but i do not feel restricted at the same time so these are actually a little bit on the relaxed fit side so i really like that they do look a little bit fitted but they also are a little bit relaxed if that makes any sense so next up we have another pair of mom jeans and these also fit really well at the waist, hip, butt, whatever, thigh area. And I don't really know how I feel about these. They don't look bad, but I do feel like they may be a little bit too tight on the waist. But other than that, they are a nice pair of jeans. These are also probably like a 27 and a half hem and the back has some gapping, but you guys know that's nothing to fix. I like these I just feel like there's nothing really that special about them if you want me to be honest um, they look like your typical mom jeans honestly I don't really have much to say about these um, I do think that a medium is a little bit too tight but a large would have been too big so I'm glad I got a medium I just can't eat before I wear these so next up we have these jeans which I featured in a previous video and they hit so different okay these jeans right here they're like cargo pant jeans if that makes any sense at all the waist is literally made to fit like you can see the i can't explain it i cannot explain it but you can tell that the waist was literally made for it to snatch you like there's no gapping at all whatsoever these jeans i featured in a previous previous sheen video and i got them in a size large but i just knew a medium would hit different so I got a medium and as you can see, these fit perfectly and the length is perfect. Okay, perfect. The waist is snatched. These, you guys, top five for sure. Definitely going to put my top five down below so you guys can check those out because these are a hit, girl. So next up we have a charcoal black-ish type of color mom jean and these are just your typical mom jean. Um, these are in a size medium and they do fit nicely. Um, like I said, I don't know how I feel about the waist area. It, it feels and kind of looks a little bit too tight, but the rest of the jean fits pretty well actually. The length of these is fine as well. I do have on sneakers, but they're definitely, I'm able to wear these with heels without it looking too weird. And I don't know, they're just, they're not stretchy. They don't have much stretch to them at all. They're like 
your typical mom jeans. When you think of mom jeans, mom jeans do not have stretch. Like I'm talking about the real, real mom jeans. Okay, usually they do not have any stretch. So these I really do like. There's really nothing too crazy about them. So we're just gonna move on to the next pair. So this is top three. This is like number one. Okay, I love these jeans so much. I featured these same jeans in a previous Shein video and I got them in a medium. But I just knew a small was gonna hit different and I got these in a small and they hit even better, okay? They fit like I wanted them to, very, very snug. The waist is like ridiculously high. Like these are super high-waisted, super high-waisted. And this wash is perfect. I love the little ties at the bottom because you guys know I already do that with my heels. So I love that that's already there because I ain't got to do it. And these fit really, 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 really well. Okay, you guys, I'm not even exaggerating. The material is nice and thick. It feels like a good quality jean. A lot of these jeans felt a little thin, like I said, but these do not. I will put my top, I'll put like my top five in the description box or in the comments for you guys so you guys can check those out. But these, hands down, my favorite jeans in this entire video. So last but certainly not least, we have these mom jeans with some like floral, kind of looks like tattoo drawings, I guess, I don't know. But these are in a size medium and I thought that these were gonna hit y'all, but I'm not really caring for the fit. I do love the design, but I wish they were on a different wash. I don't like that white patch in the middle of my thigh. I'm not a huge fan of that. These do have a nice fit low key, like the length and everything like that, but I'm not really feeling this wash with this print. I'm not really sure, you guys. Let me know what you guys think about these jeans down below. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Definitely give it a huge thumbs up. Let's get her to 3,000 good old likes. Comment down below your favorite pair and if you've tried any in today's video. Follow me on IG so you can see me style some of these in the future because, girl, some of these lit, okay? I love you guys so, so much, and I will see you all in my next one. Bye.